Kirby, I will never leave you again. I've missed you so much. Hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough. I actually don't need to travel back here, so I don't know why I hit that button of all things. I'm going inside the lore star cutter to do some poop. And you, you trickster, what do you have to say about all this? Yeah, in, in, in this part of the game, if you even if you beat the game, Magalore will still be there acting as if it's your friend. So it's actually this actually takes place technically before I finish the game. It doesn't make much sense, of course, because you you know you see me get the extra mode and stuff like that unlocked, which only happens once you beat the game and the, yeah, never mind. <laughs> I'm going to just skip through this and now over here is a bunch of rooms that are going to be unlocked. I'm going to start with the middle one then move over to that uh, upper right one and go clockwise from there I think up until I get to the final room which is right there which is unlocked by 120 energy spheres. Alright, sword room, one of my favorite powers. Here we go. I, I don't really intend on getting the high scores. You really... all you have to do is just do it quickly and combo a lot of enemies, collect a lot of things along the way. It's... Th that's really all there is to... to these special power rooms here. But I'm just gonna treat them as if they're just normal stages because all you have to do is just beat them once to get 100% in the game. Well, I should say beat them once each. Woo! Yippee! And yeah, like you see with the sword power, you can use that to squish some enemies and not get hit by other enemies. <laughs> and yeah, you get the idea. It's a race to the finish, and you can't lose your power, so feel free to be as reckless as you want to, I suppose. You know, up until that, you know, you run out of energy, <laughs> which would be a catastrophic thing. Oh, I was a little bit too late there. That is too bad. I seen that coming, and I was like, eh. Just a t tiny tad too late. What if I cut that? Nah, that doesn't help me. But I could go back up if I wanted to, I suppose. That won't squish me if I get them well. Okay. <laughs> it's just a bonus thing I suppose I could do as I go through there. I don't know which would actually be the most efficient route, so to speak. I believe if you want to get these coins, like you would have to hit that and you would have to like hit that switch to find secret routes. All these have secret routes, basically. And yeah, it's, it's got some pretty neato stuff along the way. Uh, I'm gonna tr attempt to show as much of the secret stuff as I can, but most of the secret stuff is actually pretty obvious, so you shouldn't have much trouble finding that yourself, even if you're rushing through it quickly as I am right here, because all the hidden stuff is indeed pretty obvious. And look at that, there's the goal, and I made it far before time ran out. Whoa, silver rank! And that really wasn't that good. Well, I guess, well, it wasn't that bad, I suppose, since it was a silver rank, but, ah, whatever. As I said, I'm not going to be going for the top high score thing. I'm going to leave that up to you. I'm just going to go through the stages. Indiana Jones, Kirby, let's go. Whip challenge. Oh, and it definitely would be a good idea for you to take a look at these tips, because, yeah, it just teaches you some neato stuff. Uh... Like this whip tornado thingy, which I'll show you as I'm going up some elevators. I never showed that move before. It's just something that I rarely use, which is why I never use it. <laughs> anyway, uh, I guess I would have to cut them or get them from that angle. Woo! Woo! Uh, you know, I'm just gonna skip them. <laughs> this you you would hold down and then press up to do the whip tornado thing. And it's it's like imagine you're trying to charge up Kirby to spring ahead. I mean spring up to do that. So you just oh run 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 run. And what is down? No, I, I need to angle. Wait, how do I? Do I have to? I guess I oh I, don't, I would have had to kill him from the side. That was my fault. Wait, how do I get? Is there, was there a route that I missed somewhere? Is there? I don't see any other switches. What am I missing here? Oh, I was supposed to catch you with the whip. I'm an idiot. I'm wasting too much time. Anyway, get your whip tornado out. So actually, I only need this for... Ow. <laughs> I only needed that normal whip for... Yeah, you get the idea for these here. 
No problem. Boop. And I probably should be aiming better. I should say aiming quicker too. <laughs> What's in this door? It is possibly a secret. Woo! And oh, I, I see I gotta do this. Oh, <laughs> I missed the gold, but that's okay. I have plenty of time. At least I think I do. Because I'm pretty sure the exit is right up ahead. Ah! <laughs> no tricky traps, please. Oh boy, oh my god, 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 oh Ow. <laughs> not working the slightest. I was trying to do the whip tornado. It failed. I'm not used to doing it. I don't need to do it enough to use it. I mean, you know, consistently. That was bad. <laughs> But you can always beat that last place score, because it's at, uh, 100. The new powers, I am not all that adept at using, as opposed to, uh, ones in older Kirby games like the sword, as I showed you there. And I never use the high jump a lot, so I'm probably gonna suck at this one, too. <laughs> but as long as I make it to the stage, I should be fine. You know, make it through the stage. Ah, whatever. Just gotta jump your way through everything and not hit your head on the ceiling <laughs> and oh, no 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 Ooh. and i should try to land onto the platforms a little better how did i kill all the enemies when missed the hole that is the greatest mystery uh, 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 no i should have aimed a little better there i just i mean timed it a little better but that is okay whoa Boop. and wait oh, did I, I screwed myself there didn't i <laughs> Do I want to hit these switches? Probably not. Those switches are traps to the highest degree. I bet you I wouldn't have been able to go into that door if I hit that switch below. What does that do? Oh, I see. I have to hit the... the or maybe not. Or can I just like... Ah, okay. You just do that downward thing. Wait, how do I... Do I have to like... No, that, that doesn't reach both of them at the same time then. Can I like charge it as I'm... I don't know. <laughs> I don't have much time left, man. I don't... I, it looks like that I have to do the downward thing to hit both switches at the same time, but it looks like I move far too fast to, you know, actually get them, which is pretty odd. It's funny that this power is called the high jump, but it lets you do those aerial acrobatics around corners and stuff like that. It's a much more versatile power than it, what, uh, than it used to be in older Kirby games. Especially if you're good at aiming with it. <laughs> and, woo, I'm not gonna get those, I don't think. Look ahead. Oh, whoa. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. I did. I turned myself a little too quickly. Oh, I did it again. <laughs> no, 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 no. I don't think so. Um, the high jump power is pretty fun, but it's pretty hard to master. Yeah. I knew there wasn't too much up ahead there. Oh, goodness. Oh, goodness. Oh, I'm just gonna skip that. <laughs> I didn't have much time. And there we go. Not too far away from the second place dude over there. Yoo! And bombs. I never was good with bombs, actually. Of all the powers that are decent to use, even in older Kirby games, I was never ever good with bomb. I don't know why. I, it just doesn't clash well with my play style, I suppose. <laughs> and you want to, like, chain kill enemies and stuff like that as you're going. Stuff like that for extra points. You see how this is going. Woo! And I got way too far ahead there, and I ended up saving that Poppy Brothers Jr. there. How, how hard is it to kill... <laughs> Why is it so hard to kill you? There, have a bomb. And angle it. There we go. And drop a bomb onto there as you're jump jumping across it. Eh, 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 eh. No, a little bit off. Gotta get the angle right. Eh. I would definitely need to practice this if I was speedrunning it. <laughs> eh. Ah, there we go. About time. I hope I don't run out of time, actually. And, oh, this is a moving platform segment, or I should say a moving wall platform segment. This thing is pretty large, and you don't want to be squished by it. Keep killing these crash enemies, jump towards poop to get it. Um, I want to do this, and this. There we go. Woo! 
and this one I want to throw. And I believe I have to throw at, to get all these in this one. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. I hope I didn't need that. <laughs> but I, I do know that I need one right here. Yeah, that's switch. Otherwise, I'll get squished pretty quickly. Wait, wait, wait. Actually, let's just check in this door for the fun of it real quick. <gasps> oh, can I, like... Eh, eh. Um, will I be able to have enough time? I don't know. Uh, skip it. I don't really care. <laughs> I'm not that... I'm not that enthralled by it. I think what I was supposed to do was leave a bomb there so I could, like, move on ahead. And, oh, I was jumping the gun a little bit too much there. Oh, jeez, oh, jeez. 876 543210. I made it. <laughs> I thought as much. <laughs> Why do I get the victory music for such an atrocious score? And the water challenge, here we go. Uh, there's just something about bomb that doesn't mix with the way I play. Like, I, I would prefer a power that is more along the lines of charging towards things and having more aerodynamics than one that I would have to actually stop and aim with, per se. Like, the water power is right up my alley. <laughs> and I believe I'm at, yeah, I'm supposed to do it like that. We're just doing things a little bit too far ahead of time. I believe I'm gonna have to water spout up these. Yes. I'm not sure if I. Oh, I was supposed to wait for that. Yeah, that stuff to move back down so I could charge at them in one fell swoop. Woo! I love the way they set these things up for uh, powers. Like it's like it's one big combo attack. If you were to you know do all these moves properly, unlike what I'm doing. Oh, I'm really charging into things and it's not working for me this time. <laughs> Perhaps I should try being a little more careful. Yeah. And I want to do down spouts like that. And I was probably supposed to do the run and yeah, something like that. I was probably supposed to do a downward spout then like the, the fountain thing. This thing to make myself go up or something like that. I'm just going to float through here because I'm not that adept with the water power. <laughs> Yeah, I should just be able to run right across these, right through that, and... Did I miss any secret areas? Ah, I don't care. I made it through it. We're good. Well, sort of. <laughs> I did that pretty swiftly, but not very destructive. Anyway, next one. Here we go. N needless to say, all these stages are really, really short. And, uh, wing power. Definitely another power that I love having. It's it even makes him fly a lot swifter, and it feels a lot more uh, like you're in control than you would be. Ah, oh, I did that a little bit off. <laughs> I was supposed to do. Uh, well, I'll just do it like that. Something like that. <laughs> I'm supposed to charge through those and then charge through those as well, and fly up, avoid the Gordos, collect the coins. Oh my, you guys are pretty large. And uh, not large enough, apparently. <laughs> uh, uh, uh. Should be timing my flaps a little better so I can collect all the silver coins. Whoa! Fall down faster. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm supposed to do. And I messed up on that move. Curses! <laughs> Alas! Perhaps I am not that good at winging as I thought I was, but I'm good enough, apparently, to get through this. <laughs> I would have to practice this a lot in order to get through this smoothly. Don't fall into the abyss. Don't fall in any holes either, and I missed ever so slightly down the center line, so I missed two blocks as well as enemies. Woo! And there's the end. <laughs> and now the last stage is the item challenge. It's no powers, but you use the items that you get from, like, um, like, in stages that you pick up, like, that, that boot, golf shoe, that I've been calling a golf shoe for the entire game, but I don't know its exact name, but yeah, like, you start with the key to unlock a door, and yeah, you see all the powers there, it's, it's a grand challenge of sorts, and listen to the music. Yeah. 
Yes, it is the actual green greens. Well, it, it's the green greens, but it's like all the generations of green green music in a row. It's all oh, poopers. I wanted to get up there. Um, it's like it switches from the SNES, SNES, Game Boy, Nintendo 64. It is an awesome music little uh, compilation of green greens. It just makes you actually think about, oh my goodness, oh my goodness. <laughs> think about how many how many times you've heard this song and, and how many times it's been remixed and how many times you just can't help but smile listening to it. <laughs> And needless to say, you have to be very careful not to get squished as you're going through. Oh, and don't lose your thing there, otherwise you can't get in the door. <laughs> yeah, aim well, my friend, aim well, and also jump well. <laughs> this item right here is probably one of the more broken items in the game. It's just complete and utter domination as long as you make your jumps. <laughs> I mean, even, even when you're moving down, you know, going between enemies like this, it's... It just steamrolls them. Well, except for those Gordos, but Gordos are Gordos and will always be Gordos. And there's something in here, I'm sure. Yay! Alright, what am I... Oh, the invisible crystal. Can I... Oh, yeah, I can. So I need this. But I have to... No. Can I, like, throw it? No, I can't throw it out when I grab it. Can I, like, throw that? Uh, I bet you I'm gonna have to throw it up to... Come on. I know I have to get it up there! Can I, like, charge my throw before I jump? No, I can't. Can I, like, throw it from the ground? How about from here? No, that's not gonna work. I know I'm right next to the exit anyway, so it doesn't really matter if I waste too much time here. <laughs> get it! Up! Freaking... Yeah, because you can't take that through there as well as the crystal, and you, you get the idea. Maybe I have to... Maybe I can't bonk my head on the ceiling, oh, but I'm still bonking my head on the ceiling. I'm not going to get a good rank, but I would like to get this puzzle solved. I'm just trying to figure out how to do it. No, that's not going to work. It's I was trying to, like, jump and then charge, I mean, hold my... Uh, one button as I was trying to jump up, but that doesn't seem to work, but this does seem- Oh, there we go. I was gonna say, it does seem to be something that I'm supposed to do. It just felt like it. it there, there didn't seem to be any other way to get those things. There we go. Yeah, I don't need that anymore. Yeah, yeah, I know. <laughs> and... Oh wait, maybe I'm not that close to the end, because I had that- Oh boy, maybe I shouldn't have wasted that much time there, and I shouldn't have got- Oh my, oh dear. <laughs> I am starting to panic a little bit here, but I can tick my way across. Or maybe not. <laughs> well, I can always restart this from the beginning, I suppose. That was just to show the side route of all things anyway. Yeah, I'm not going to have enough time for this, am I? Because I'm going to have to walk across this on this boot on my... Yeah. Okay, I'll see you when I get back over here. Alright, we're back in this section with a lot more time, because I wasn't wasting time this time. <laughs> and we're at the spike ball section. Gotta say, this boot can endure quite a lot of stuff. And this time, let's not get ourselves killed by timeout and just, you know, actually try not to waste any time. <laughs> And there we go. Do I want to break? Well, I can if I want to, to get this bomb of sorts. And I can use that to break that thing open, I guess. But do I want to take it to a higher level? I probably do. Oh my, I did not mean to do that. <laughs> but if I broke it up there... Oh, that would, that would have actually made the thing break apart. Oh, wait, 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 wait a second. I need... I need that, don't I? If I go back in here... Uh-oh. Yeah, I don't think I can do this now. Uh-oh. It was that specific on... Oh! It needed that one bomb and... Uh, 
Alright, I'm back here again, and I just noticed the exit was actually down there, so I didn't have to do this at all. This is just a side path, apparently, so... I... yeah, I really didn't need to retry this stage at all. Whoopsie doodle. Anyway, let's just... yeah... And then jump all the way down here. Oh, look at that, I solved the puzzle of death. <laughs> anyway, there's the exit, would you look at that? Oh, that was pretty decent, and that stage is actually pretty hard. <laughs> well, that's all I'm going to be doing here, and I'm going to show this off as well before I do anything. Observe, 100% clear. I really don't have to do anything more except for the arena. <laughs> but I'm going to be showing off more of this game, of course. But there you go, you are now at 100% completion. I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you in the next part when we go down there and do the mini-games.